Okay, I've read through the entire sales letter and I realize um, that it's a, the owner of this product is providing a crack for um, the Wii um, software um, console or the game console. And um, you're providing a, a means by which they can improve the uh, at least the game console and you're looking at the ways in which you can add to the capabilities of the product that they have already um, bought okay um for the the wii owners um be careful um trying to unlock the wii is dangerous and even irreparable i'm not sure how this would actually work as a headline because it's not really giving them a benefit this is more like a uh, a warning and um why would they try to unlock their wii and um, it is not telling me why okay so I think this is kind of a iffy for a headline um, because you are you're warning them about something that I'm not sure you're actually giving a reason why they would want to do this okay now if we are assuming that everybody who is gonna to come to this page know that it's possible it's possible to unlock um, the we we can game console um, then um, this would be quite targeted, but I think is the, the real benefit is actually expanding on the capability of the of the Wii, and the warning can come as a side note. Okay, to say well, um, um, discover how you can you know add and expand. You know, in other words, give a benefit, give a benefit headline, and then you can make this this warning as being a sub um, as being a subhead. Okay, now if you are looking to unlock your Wii and install the homebrew channel, this could be the most important. Okay, this is where it comes in later on. Um, okay, so um, this idea should have come, you know, um, earlier than, you know, than later. Okay, if you're looking to unlock your Wii and install the homebrew channel, this should be, the, this is the most important article that you'll ever read. Okay, it's actually a letter. Okay, so I would use that as a letter rather than a um, uh, uh, okay um, okay dear we owner um, it's best if you use contractions so here you have um, I'm okay M makes it more conversational I'm not sure about you but many we owners are frustrated and angered because the we makers attach a DVD drive to it but didn't give you the ability to play um, DVDs on it okay they start another letter by saying that you're not sure um, is a kind of weak way of starting out. Okay, you want to be sure. You want to be definite. You want to be um, certain. Okay, you want to be, you know, confident that you actually know who your customer is and what they're actually looking for. Okay, um, but it didn't give you the ability to play DVDs on it. Okay, so this is a problem. As a matter of fact, if you really want to play DVDs on your Wii system, whether they are downloaded games or even movies, you need to use complex hacks and install Modchip. Even then, there's a high probability that instead of getting unlocked, your Wii can end up. Okay, this is a good paragraph because it's giving them the the it's agitating the problem. It is saying um, what would happen if they were to try to do it on their own and without proper guidance. Okay. Okay, let's continue. Here, something you were here, something that you were not you were not told. Um, here's something you were not told. Um, I think something you're not told is like a secret or something that is hidden from you okay so rather than something you were not told uh, maybe like something say something that you don't know okay um, I'm just saying that it's something you were not told is like something like a secret something that is kept from you and it could be said you know in one word rather than something you were not told okay you, um, you need to be either an engineer or a very tech savvy person to be able to use those complex hacks that people keep talking about okay this is very um, this is very vague as well too uh, what are those complex hacks that people are talking about they're not very specific are these hacks that um, that people on forums are discussing um, say something more than those hacks that people are talking about it's very this is very um, generic and, and, and very um, tame it need to be a little bit more specific I even had some neighborhood kids um, come to me because they had somehow damage their Wii console while trying um, while trying out these hacks okay therefore don't try this at home um, unless okay what is what is what is this 
is not clear what don't try what at home um, using the hack or support okay I'll make this clearer say what this is unless you are an electronic engineer or how do you expert to know the ins and outs of the console but why should you listen to me on scroll okay the, the but why should you listen to me comes in as a kind of a bump here in other words there's no smooth transition between this paragraph and this one okay um, you know so the, the but you know the construction is introducing something that is opposite or contrary to what you you mentioned before um, okay so you mentioned here that you know you shouldn't try it at home and um, you know like who you shouldn't listen to but listen to me okay so the transition here is a little bumpy here's why I'm an electronic engineer and I have helped lots of kids as well as a few adults to unlock their Wii they were frustrated because they weren't able to use the full potential of Wii and help them to do it I have taught 12 year olds and 50 year olds um, to, un, um, to unlock the, um, the Wii okay so it's, it's, it's saying that he's an electronic engineer and what he um, has done before um, it doesn't really qualify the person except you're saying that you know you have helped um, other people okay um, how long have they been an electronic engineer how long have they been uh, working with um, the the, the um, game boxes and unlocking them and so forth okay that would give a little bit more credibility than just saying okay I've helped a few kids do this before okay here's what others are saying about the homebrew installer um, um, guide I would make sure that this is indented okay so it fits in like you know this area right here it stands out and also you try as much as possible as well to not to like you see like um here's what and then you have a following paragraph that starts the same way okay you need a sense of variety um variety here okay now here's how john ross says about being able to play regional games okay i i realize that these are i think this is the gmail console and uh, email console and um, you actually um using these uh, you know um, emails as testimonials you know which is good it, this makes it realistic you know it kind of shows that um, that um, these you know these are real people um, it's written in the language of of those persons except that um, with testimonials it's, it's, it's nice to pull out a headline from the testimonial itself and also uh, when you read through the testimonial it's kind of indicated here that the owner of the product actually solicited these testimonials Okay, so these are not these are these are not non-solicited testimonials. These are solicited testimonials. In other words, then um, these testimonials were asked for of the um, of the product owner. Okay, so I would like I would want to downplay the fact that these testimonials were asked for. Um, you want the testimonials seem to be as volunt um, to be as voluntary uh, as um, as as um, as um, voluntary and. Um, the, that that it comes you know from from the person's initiative rather than that the testimonials were asked for okay um, okay so here's another testimonial the same as well too okay here's here's what my method um, is all about you know as I said I'm an electrical engineer with have my many views truthfully almost every kid in the neighborhood came to me okay this is not really adding anything new and it's not the letter is not long enough to have to summarize what you have said before okay um, sometimes you need to summarize but normally when the letter is really long but this is something that you just said so this add kind of bow okay if it came later on where you're summarizing you know then i become but to summarize what you just said two or three paragraphs ago become unnecessary repetition and um you know repetition is good and summary is good but normally you have a longer sales letter and i don't think that it really justifies um using um, a summary quite so soon okay and I'm talking any part of not just unlocking nothing okay this is a repetition of what we said before and therefore I came up with a guide called the homebrew guide where I guide you to um, here okay and again repetition as well too you came up with a guide you know that will guide you. try to find a different word to use um, you know that would uh, I came up with a guide that would lead you um, and it's an installer guide and here guys so you have three guys in one sentence okay try to use a different word so I came up with a guide um, or I came up with a manual called the Homebrew Installer Guide that would lead you step by step through how to unlock your Wii within 30. So, okay, so try to find a different word or a different phrase in here for guide, guide, instead of guide, guide, guide. Okay, the Homebrew Installer Guide, um, again, contraction, you'll um, discover 
Okay, how to unlock your Wii yourself safely, safely without difficulty, whether you are 12 years old. How you can unlock your Wii safely without voiding the, um, without voiding the warranty. Okay, this is kind of repetition as well too. You just say unlock it safely. Okay, how you can install the home channel without having to crack open your Wii or tamper with the hardware. Of course, I won't try to teach you. Okay, this could maybe like be bracketed because it's a kind of parenthetical idea. Uh, with this guide, you want to, with this guide, you won't need to do any sort of tampering with the hardware. It is a software based method and doesn't need any tampering. Okay, this is basically saying the same thing here as well, too. Okay, so be careful for this repetition of the ideas that you've had before. It made it, it makes it appear as though you're kind of trying to pad the letter and make it longer than um, it actually is. There are the bullet point benefits that you can actually come up with um, here rather than repeating the same thing over again. Okay, how you can turn your Wii Multimedia Entertainment instead of a Wii console. Um, you'll finally be able to play DVDs and MP3s and Wii DVD player. Not only this, you will also be able to play games like things and so forth. Okay, so they can play other games. Um, and there's a homebrew, it's on a bonus pack in Nintendo Switch. Okay, this comes also as a bump as well too. Okay, it comes as a bump. After the bullet points, I will kind of maybe write one or two paragraphs here. Um, to talk a little bit maybe about the benefits of the of the um, of owning this um, cheat uh, manual um, but this come here as a bump like uh, you know the bonuses already okay the, here you need a smoother transition um, here Nintendo which we get cheat thousands of things okay and, and when you're adding a bonus it's always good as well to indicate the value okay the monetary value so um, if this would normally cost $27 or $10 or $27, whatever it is, um, indicate what the value is when you are giving bonuses. Okay, um, we'll see. Simple step-by-step -step instruction even a dummy can follow. Uh, okay, I have written the instructions in a step-by-step -step manner. Nothing is left out. Even if you had, had called in a professional to do it for you, he would not have done a better job than you would be able to do with than you would be able to do with homebrew okay it's a little wording can take some editing than you can do with homebrew installer guide and he and and he would have charge okay would have um he would not um be careful for those repetition as well okay and this entire paragraph could be tightened okay it could be edited down but you okay what you won't have to um, have much for the claim. The price of the guide is for the 95 people are happily paying for it every day, but um, but you could buy it today at a special, or you can get it today instead of buy at a special price of 40% off, which means that you get it for only 29.95. You'll get an instant download even if you buy at 2 a.m. in the morning. Okay, there's a lot of different thoughts that is expressed um, here that comes one after the other and could flow a little better. Okay, so, um, but you won't have to pay that much for the homebrew guide. And the price of guide is important and, and people are happily paying for this every day. But you could get it today for a special um, discount. Okay, so what's good to, what's good to do is um, is to do a cross out. Okay, like you have $49.95 and you do a cross out and, and um, you know, you put it $49.95 and you do the cross out and then you show the present price okay below so it could be clear it's, you know you're 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 explaining you're explaining it here okay whereas it could be shown by just a cross out okay okay and here's another testimonial as well i mentioned about the testimonial you want to pull out a headline and also kind of tone down the fact that this testimonial was solicited okay now the decision is yours you could either buy today at the cell phone internet and get the Wii unlocked today or you could just leave this page right now and try to do it on your own okay this is why i called um um intimidation um here okay i will make it even easier for you to decide with my ironclad try out home brain still and take it to the test use it on your controller as you can see i am the one um taking the taking the risk i'm well aware that some people surely that you will download i i, I think that you could leave this out okay you do not want to insult the um the prospect by telling them, well, it's a possibility that they are a thief, okay, that they would steal your product, okay. So I would leave, you know, I would leave this out. And um, in 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 fact, the nature of the the nature of the product is that um, you're taking a a console, 
uh, you're taking a console that was made by a manufacturer and you're expanding the um, the capabilities of it okay and um, this is like a hack for a product so it's almost like the product that you're selling is actually hacking um, the the product made by another manufacturer so um, indicating that someone can actually steal your um, steal your product kind of bring your own bring the owner's own ethics into question since they you know they are they are doing something to the uh, um, you know their product that it wasn't designed okay why that it wasn't designed for so I wouldn't mention this at all I would mention the fact that okay there are some people who might just um, buy and, and 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 get a refund and in fact you could be putting ideas in people's mind by saying that so I wouldn't I wouldn't um, okay I wouldn't um, mention this at all okay download the homebrew installer guide right now okay and um, and uh, okay click here to buy okay um, um, add to cart um, is being very is shown to be very effective um, instead of saying buy now you can use the button that says add to cart okay and so here you have your PayPal buttons and your buy okay um, you should ha also have the signature of the person who wrote the letter okay let's check the PS Okay, uh, within minutes of downloading this guy, you will be able to unlock your Wii and start playing your favorite game, whether it is a, a downloaded game or a backup game. Okay, that's a summary. Okay, not bad. In case you need tech support, just send me an email and we will answer your question as soon as possible. You don't just get a guy, you get um, your support. Okay, after that as well too, I'll put some more space between these and you also might want another call to action down here. In other words, and call the person to, um, to buy the, um, the product. Okay, the product at this point. Mm. okay so let's go over okay not a very long letter um, but let's go over um, just to summarize um, some suggestion that I have okay I would suggest um, also changing this to to change the headline to red uh, make sure that it is in um, indented um, is indented here okay I mentioned the headline it maybe it's best to use a benefit um, headline and use the warning as a um, use the warning as a sub sub headline and um okay use one and some headline okay i mentioned um some some editing but the structure of the letter is not bad in the sense that you can you know you, you've indicated the problem you indicated the solution to the problem and, and how this could be um should be solved okay you need to work on some benefits um some bullet um points and um, benefits you have given some yes but they are really um you know uh, different version of the same point maybe you want to brainstorm a little to think about you know how much money they would save on using this um, product um, you know the, the how, how, how safe it is to use it um, um, what they'll be able to do now that they have this product and you know um, okay so that would go into the the benefit <laughs> the benefit section of the um, of the letter okay it's not a okay it's not a very expensive product so you don't really have to do a lot a lot of selling in, act, in actually in order to make this um in order to make this this sale um but you need to you know to reassure them that uh, the guarantee I, I would set up the guarantee to say if they're not satisfied they can always you know get their money back and you don't have to be afraid of people who take advantage of um you know who take take advantage of um of you Okay, so um, be careful about repetition. A lot of things that you mentioned and you've mentioned over again, uh, be careful for um, for that. And um, you know, you work on a, a new uh, a new headline. Be careful about the transitions that I mentioned um, um, before, and this should be able to um, help you improve the letter overall.